What is up guys, welcome back to another video. You guys already know this is episode four of the Cahaba River series. This is part one and let me explain why. Right here, I am going to do Lost Lake Loop, but I'm gonna take the Lost Lake Loop with it by itself. And then in the second part of this Lost Lake Loop, I'm gonna will take high voltage. That way you guys can see the entirety of all these trails right here. There's also this little baby one called Flycatcher, which I can also do for you guys. But today we're only gonna do the Lost Lake Loop by itself. And then in part two, you guys will see it'll be the Lost Lake Loop with the extension of high voltage. So I hope you guys like that. Um, but yeah, today's gonna be a pretty simple trail. And by the way, I've been here before. The Lost Lake Loop is very beautiful. I recommend you guys to check it out just as well to check out all of the other trails here. Um, but yeah very beautiful view also if you guys want me to fish the lake let me know in the comments down below because i'm also willing to take down a rod there someday and show you guys but without further ado let's get started so if you guys remember correctly this is exactly where we ended in episode three so right here if you guys make it this far just make sure to take a right follow the sign because over there we're about to do lost lake loop all right make sure you follow the signs go to lost lake loop on the right Go this way. Here we can go straight or take a right, it doesn't matter, it's a loop. So we're gonna go right. Here it is, this is Lost Lake Loop. Just look how beautiful that is. Alright guys, so basically I stopped the video here for a second because I just want you guys to appreciate, you know, how beautiful this all really looks in the nice beautiful green grass there's a lost lake and then we're basically just gonna go on this little trail that goes all the way around around the lake and then back out that way but yeah so i just wanted you guys to see how cool this is to so make sure to come here check this out yourselves also if you guys want me to fish this you know drop a comment down below it looks really juicy it looks really nice and I'm sure nobody has fished it, so I'm sure nobody fishes it like that often. So I think it'll be good fishing if there's even fish. But yeah, I just wanted to stop the video, you know, so you guys can see it, take it in, and then get back on it. All right, see you guys in the trails. All right, here we go. grass. There's some sticks right here. You're going to take a left. So make sure you guys watch out when you guys come by. 
Oh, so watch out for the spiders because there's lots and lots of spiders, spider webs and everything. I jump over this too. All right. Messing up. All right, let's keep going. Here we can take a left. We can go down here. Some tall grass. If you guys want a little challenge, you guys can go down here. Oh, it's a little overgrown, but it's doable. And that's it. That's the loop. Well, yeah, guys, that was the loop. Um, you can see it was very beautiful. I will say it has been a while since anybody has ridden this, it, it seems like. So I guess just watch out for stumps and trees on the way. And over here, there was a little bit of overgrown grass. If you guys want the little challenge, just go over this, this rocks. Um, but yeah, also another thing to notice is that there's a lot of different ways that you guys can complete the loop. Um, so you guys saw me pass a lot of lefts and a lot of rights. And even here, there's like another entrance, but it all goes to the same loop. Um, you guys can do this however you want. You can take it with the extension of high voltage, which is this one actually, or even with fly catcher and stuff like that. So um, yeah, just if you guys come out here, you know, be careful with the wildlife. You know, always stay safe, but also have fun and explore and try the new different trails. But yeah, I know I had fun doing it. I hope you guys have fun doing it if you guys try it out. Again, let me know down in the comments what you guys think of the video, the new camera angle and stuff like that. But everything is really appreciated. Any comments or likes, anything like that. But until next time, peace.